Deep sea pink sea urchins aggregate to feed on decaying seaweed. To adapt to climate change, they've been expanding their habitat by an average of 3.5 meters per year. As climate change pushes from one end and hard physical limits prevent species from migrating away, species are being squeezed, according to two recent reports. The effects of climate change are causing species to seek higher ground on land and underwater. However, there are limitations on how far species can migrate upwards, as mountains peak and eventually water meets the shore, meaning plants and animals that are adapting now may not be able to do so in the future. According to a study recently published in Deep Sea Research Part 1, Oceanographic Research Papers, pink sea urchins, also known as Strongylocentrotus fragilis, are highly mobile and have been expanding their range upwards by an average of 3.5 meters per year over the last 14 years, totaling 49 vertical meters, equivalent to the height of a 14-story building. The lead author of the study, Ryland Command, a University of Victoria Science alumnus and a master's student in the 4D Oceans Lab at the Marine Institute of Memorial University of Newfoundland, explains that two primary factors are driving the upward movement of the pink sea urchins. First, as ocean temperatures increase, warmer water holds less oxygen than colder water, and areas with low oxygen levels expand, compelling animals to seek out more oxygenated water. Second, the coastal ecosystem was thrown into turmoil by the marine heatwave known as the blob that occurred from 2013 to 2016, which had an impact on the food sources of the pink sea urchins. The blob disrupted how cold, nutrient-rich water flowed up from the deep and changed ocean temperatures, impacting plant life in shallow water. As a result, there has been less dead plant material drifting to the deep for sea urchins to feed on. Thank you for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe for more. Please also leave your comments and we love to hear from you.